Beastly basketball. Beastly basketball. Beasts roasters. Joe, height five feet eight inches. Beast crane. Favorite book, Jelly Bay, weight, 130 pounds, skill, identity, and gracefulness. Tim, height, 5 feet, 2 inches, Beast Monkey, favorite book, Troll Hunters, weight, 140 pounds, skill, goofiness, and abacators. Height, height. Five feet, three inches, Beast, Tiger, favorite book, Jake Maddox, Maddox Sport Novels, weight, 134 pounds, skill, Furience, Furiously, and Lotely, Kyle, height, five feet, four inches, Beast, Snake, favorite book, the Frankenstein jur Journals. Weight, 122 pounds. Skill, sneaks and quickiness. quickness. Thomas, height, 5 feet, 4 inches. Beast, Mantis, favorite book. Enchanted Emperor's Emperor series. Hey, height, weight, 115 pounds. Quick reflexes and eye and hand coordinates. In the final game of the season, the carnivals face the beasts. One, as one, the beasts are storming down the opposite opposition. They will get the game's final shot. The shot is up. Please go in. Please don't go in. Oh my, world, what a finish. Ladies and gentlemen, the winners and the season's champions are the... Three months earlier. Think I will make the team this year, Thomas. I don't think we'll even have five players trying out year this year, Kyle. What what's the point anyway? Even if we don't get five players, we'll never beat the car carnivals. No, with the, you on our team, Oscar. So, where's the coach? Should he be here? You know, present, present our tryouts. He's probably quit when he saw Thomas playing. Ha, good one, Oscar. Who cares? Why isn't coach here? We don't even have enough players to make the team. I quit. This year, Thomas quit before he even made the team. Hey. Off. Bump. Dude, watch where you're going. Hi. Um. My name is Joe. Is it too late for to try out for the team? Why? Why would you bring your pajamas? Pajamas. Oh, that. It's my Kung Fu G. Seriously? You practice Kung Fu? Yup. Well, I used to. Lame. How's it going, fellas? Everything all right? Just saying hi to the new guy, Coach. Hey, Coach. Thanks again for the invita invitation to try out. Hey, Joe. Glad to see you could make it. Fellas, listen up. 
This is Joe. He's trying out for the team. How do you know, coach? He invited me to try out a week ago. We met outside my Kung Fu studio. Why is a why is a Kung Fu dude trying out for the team? Can you even play basketball? You see, before my Kung Fu studio closed, great, a great flashback. See, my classmates and I were met, met behind the building before Kung Fu classes started. We played basketball to warm up. Our, our Shifu or Kung Fu instructor or organizedly suggested we do we do it. We all loved Kung Fu and we loved basketball. As it turn, turns out the two have a lot in common with each other. Perfect perfect un on Ishan, on Ishan. Our class spent most of the free time together doing activities or other. Unlike some other studios, we became true a true team until the studio closed. And that's when Coach saw me and asked me to try out. So here I am. Yeah, great story and all, but are you good anyway? Are you good? Are you any good? Yes, please teach me karate. Please teach me karate, Mr. Bruce Lee. Actually, Thomas, your idea isn't bad. One, it, one. Isn't bad. Isn't a bad one. It couldn't hurt. It couldn't hurt to learn some kung fu after practice. What? What do you say, Joe? Wanna be our team fifth member, and our our honorary kung fu coach? Guess that could be cool. Count me in. <gasps> We're doomed. Okay, boys, practice has officially started. Let's start with some passing. The first thing didn't go so well. Down here, dude. Ow, boink. Sorry, boink. Run, play seven. Practice week two. Practice week two. Run, play seven. Um, what do we do for that play again? Well, good news. Well, good news is that our team is pretty talented, but eventually, the bad news, our team is, our team kind of stinks. Our first Kung Fu practice didn't go well either. Now, off, kick, punch. Ow, 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 ow. Yow. But eventually, the team started to get better. Not bad. Nice work, guys. Now that I have seen your strengths and martial arts, it's time to assign each of you and practically style of kung fu that matches match that matches your talent and personalities. Oscar is a real tiger, furious yet strengthly. Kyle is fud, fud, and he has great timing like a snake. Tim is goofy and uh, agile like a 
really funky monkey. Quick and sneaky Thomas is Drew playing Mantis. As for me, I'm a crane, all the way swift and graceful. Interesting. Let's put these skills to use on the court. We started with unbounding run mates. Hands, hands up. Then moved on to defense posing. Then we started pass. Passing drills. I was shooting from needed some work too. And we didn't forget to have fun. What a bunch of wild animals. Hmm, scribble, scribble. One month later. Great shot, Tim. Keep your wrist loose and you'll get more. Rotation on the ball. The all right, bring it in, fellas. I'm proud of you guys. You're five very different individual, invisible, coming together as a team. And I thought our uniform should reflect that fact. Cool. This is awesome. It makes me look good. Sweet, not bad. Wow. Looking good, boys. Game one, game one of season tips. Game one of our season tips off. The ball goes to the Knights. He shoots, he scores. Nice saw, better pass. Oscar off, Oscar off the beast charges. Oscar goes for a layup and sing, sinks the shot and we're on the scoreboard. The tiger, sh the tiger strikes. Nice work, Oscar. Don't don't have any kung fu jokes. Ha <laughs> ha. Enter the tiger. Thanks, dudes. The night. The knights are. Cur. Cur. Clustling down the court. He drives for a layup. Wow, Kyle comes out of nowhere and steals the ball mid play. That kid was quick as a snake, indeed. Kyle passes catch later that game. The Beast push the ball up to the court. Joe drives. To the rim. He shoots. Oh, he misses. Clang. But that was a dunk of a dunk ap appetite at his age. Shake it off, Joe. Get back on D. With that basket, the Knights had pulled ahead. Get back on defense faster, beasts. I'm open, Tim. Tim is pulling off some strange moves out there, but he sinks a hook shot. Nice moves, monkey man. Thanks. Only 20 seconds left on the clock. The knights have the ball. The beasts are down by one. Joe, Joe. Illigent blocks the shot. With a little time remaining, the beasts charge down the court. 
This will be the last play of the game, folks. Whoosh, whoosh. What an amazing display of passing. Bzzz. The Beast win the first game of the season. Great job, boys. You played very much like the team, especially on the last play. I'm proud of you, you your efforts tonight. Please get down from there, Tim. Psst, Joe, are you crazy? What's with the drunk appetite? I have been practicing my crane slam for months. I never pulled it off before, but I thought I could do I could tonight. Your little stunt almost cost us the game. Sorry. Later on the drive back to school. Hey Joe, got a second? Um, oh, um, sure. Um, I'm looking for uh, feedback on my recent sketches. Wow, they're amazing. Is this how you came up with the idea for the uniforms? Yep. Can I can I say you inspired me and the team here? This is for you. Thank coach. Cool. Thanks coach. Cool. The next few few games flew by. The Beast win the second game in a row. The Beast win the third game, straight game. The third straight game. They're officially on a strike. The Beast win their fourth game in a row. The Beast simply cannot be stopped. It's a black blowout win for the Beasts. Yet. Yeah. Another big win for the Beast. They'll be undefeated going into the final game of the season against and also undefeated Carnivals. The day before the season's last game. Hey guys, sorry I'm late. No worries, we're just warming up. Bring it, bring it in, boys. Tip is... Tip off is in a few minutes. I know this is the final game of the season, so I should probably give a speech. I'll just say that it it had been an honor to coach you guys. Team on three. Team. Team. The first play. Your karate junk won't work on us. What a whatever. Kung Fu is not karate. Nothing but yet. Let's go. Re, re reject. I got it. I'm open. Swoosh the B score with an impressing effort from Kyle. A moment later, swoosh, and the Cardinals sink a three-pointer. What an instant game. Halftime is upon us so far. The Cardinals and the Beasts are treating us to quite a show. Later, you know what to do, Joe. I do. Go wild beast. Let's get your air bone. Swoosh. 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 Wow. Is that even legal? I'm not sure. But it's pretty creative teamwork. I allow it. The final the final day I finally did it I hit my crane slam thanks dude 
No problem, just figure out you could use a leg up. Moments later, a, a steal by the beasts. Another great pass by Tim. And Kyle hits the sneaky jumper and puts the beast within one point of the carnivals. Yes! Out of time. Time out. Only 10 seconds left. Game and the Cavan. Cavs have the ball. Well, we we will need to get a creative. We need to get a creative to win. Any ideas, Joe? Say let Mantis make the call. We need someone clever to pull this win out. Me? Sounds good to me. All. It's all up to you, Thomas. Okay, here. What will we do? Okay. Okay, then here's what we'll do. Thomas' plan was simple but brilliant. Whisper. Whisper, whisper. First, he left their worst shooters wide open. Hey, you could not take the wide open shot. Hey, you could you could not take the wide open shot. And sure enough, he missed and was snagged in the rebound. From the point, it was a matter of quick passing. Bounce, swoosh, and teamwork. Flick, the shot was in the air. Gaff, going in. Bzzz. Gaff, what a finish. The leagues and gentlemen winners of the season champions are the Beasts. Nice move, Mantis. What can I say? I'm a beast. Just like the rest of us.